Lift you smell what the rock is cooking. And do my ears deceive what I'm hearing from the rock? You know what? Matter of fact, of course he out here cooking because he wants a seat at the table. And when you cook, don't you want to eat what you done set out, what you done spread? Because the rock surely does. And that's what he plan on doing. All right, to be honest, I know it was like rumor, tease, and stuff like that. You know, he put it out there when he was doing like the whole like, uh, I was like, I think it was a kid that he was uh, like talking to and stuff like that. And he sort of teased it. But, you know. All that type of stuff we sort of just see as a tease, you know, kind of just things like, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, you're talking good, you know, from the kids giving the people what they want, that kind of thing, marking up the water. Not too different than, like, you know, what Singer Punk was sort of doing a few months ago before he, like, showed up and stuff. So maybe we should have put it a little bit together. But I, I think a lot of, like me, you, them, they, those, whatever you want to say, we didn't really think – he would go like it would be fully in half. Now, let's back up and let's go to the whole segment. He came out, Jinder Mahal, you know, they, you know, did a little banter thing. And one, I thought it was really funny and stroke of genius that you would do that huge tease and then Jinder Mahal came out. Because they got good camera footage of people being like, Man, what the hell is this? What? And you even heard like the crowd starting to be like, like the what? Like this, like this, them BS. But it did so like it did with Vince McMahon, men, like days. This is probably actually what we might get, and then we probably would get a really lackluster like former heavyweight champion that came out or something like that. But this being Triple H, okay, you knew what it was gonna be, Jenner Mahal. But who? Would it be? Now, I was trying to figure. I was like, I was like, man, who could it be? Who would it be? Beforehand, I'm like, mm, who have we seen in a while? That kind of thing. Then, about the time that Jinder Mahal was, you know, dogging out, you know, doing the whole dogging out America thing and dogging out and saying, you know, talking about like, you know, you didn't even like how you, uh, your country and Punjabi and stuff. That's actually when I was actually thinking. I was like, "Yo, is it? It's going to be the Rock." It. I don't. I. And it's funny enough that Jinder Mahal pointed out that like as soon as I start uh, attacking America and attacking all the people, they bring you out here. Because I'm not going to lie. He like he's one of like like three choices in my head, but maybe even two. Cause Stone Cold be the only one I could think of. But I was like, but Stone Cold come here to whoop ass in a different way than, than the Rock whooping ass. Anyway, I I was like, I wasn't shocked it was a Rock, but I was surprised it was a Rock. But then some way halfway through it, I also knew it was a Rock. It's really weird. I was like, my mind was all over the place. Anyway, Rock came out, did his whole thing, you know, made the little funnies, you know, went back and forth. Blah, 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 blah. Then towards the end, he's over here like, yo. I I thought he was he he said that where he's like, hey, I'm hungry. You know, should I go to eat in the booth? Should I go and eat at the bar? And you know, the crowd like, yeah, a bar. Cause I felt like they sort of was all thinking like, okay, this is one of his ways of being like, yo, if you see me out, don't be afraid to like, you know, or something like that. That's what I thought it was gonna be doing something like base to get the crowd cheering again. Then he said, eating at the head of the table. And, like I said, it's already been teased, been teasing interviews. Yeah, I think he's done, he done something like this on, like, Twitter or something like that. You were for this. But this was, but, but to say it in person is, like, the definite stamp or the, the, the momentum that's the halfway through the door, step, you got your foot in your door way of being like, okay, they ain't. They setting this up for WrestleMania. This is what this is what they're gonna do. Now, you know, it can still just be a tease. It can still it can still just be talking halfway out the side of your neck. Cause I mean, 
we still got about like three more months until WrestleMania. You know, so anything could change. This might just this could just be used to fuel quote unquote Cody's story. You know, to make it look like it's really in peril because like the rock comes up, you ain't gonna get your story. And then we just don't get no rock and roman. It was just all in the bit. Now I I think that route might not be the best. You know, I was like that that route might be sort of like you know like Roman winning the Royal Rumble and having the Rock come out there to, to help him. Everybody's like, no, we ain't for it. Or you know, other years where like it's like start. You know, I I was like, I think that people would be fine. I mean, you're gonna have you're gonna have to split down the people anyway. But I think people will be fine if we got Rock and Roman. But I think if you tease the Rock the whole time, nearly leading up to WrestleMania, don't give us Rock and then give us Cody, then it would be like a little sour like consolation prize. And I don't think that's the route you want to go. So I think it's something that we got that is going to be figured out real quick. But that's a future. That's a future problem. Probably a future thing. I I. I talking about videos or whatnot, but for right now, The Rock teases the big of the big matches, and apparently Roman already did, like, he uh, responded with, like, a little crying emoji, so he's in on it, and so now it's like, do, do, do you pull the plan? Do you, do you pull it? Do, what do you do? You know, I, hey, we still got a while for the Rumble. You know, we still got like a good like two, three weeks. So, I to be honest, to be honest, before he says, I uh, in at the head of the table, I thought he actually was going to say, I'm entering the Royal Rumble. That's what I thought he was going to do. Just, I was like, because that's a, that's a different kind of tease. Because now he's in the Rumble. Now it's like, oh. Just, just, I was like, cause now, cause that affects a lot more people. Cause now it's like, we already, I was like, I, I feel like it's sort of safe to say that we sort of might not believe that Cody wasn't the Royal Rumble, but that it's also sort of put some dampers in it to see him punk win the Royal Rumble. And you know, the see him punk rock thing from back in the day, that's already, that's a thing as well too. But then you got the rock that's in the Royal Rumble. So then it's like, does he win it or, you know, like that way is kind of like, Cause then you also got to place this match and combine it in a way to be like, okay, how does the Rock get that? Get the shot though, you know. I mean, yes, we could do the whole somebody that shows up, you challenge the gold birthday, you next. You know, we 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 could do that, but that's another that's another that's another problem. I guess that's a good problem. I guess to have coming up. He actually said it today to actually get it. Everybody talking. Everybody wondering, everybody wanting to know, everybody feeling like it's a done deal, and that we also gonna put Cody on the back burner. And I think until it's time for the execution, this is a good problem to have because just like The Rock when he came back on SmackDown, just like when CM Punk showed up at the Survivor Series, CM Punk showing up on Raw like his first Raw. CM Punk showing up at Madison Square Garden. Guess what? It did. You know it's gonna do numbers. Day one, man. I was like, it then whatever comes after that, it's a good. It's gonna be a good problem to have. It's just going to be one of them things that's like, it, it's going. It's going. It's gonna be one of them things that divide. I feel like divides the wrestling community. It really will. I was like. Is but I think but at the same time I think that's great. Like I, I'm fine regardless. I was like I, I just enjoy to watch shows, but some of y'all that take it really to heart. Woo! Y'all go y'all gonna y'all gonna feel it. You know, I was like this is gonna be a real like like no he we can that can now can also too Okay, we're gonna get rock and roman. Anybody believe that the Rock gonna win? I mean, does does Cody finish his story on another day? 
I'm just, I'm just saying, there's been a lot of ways you can go. Can't make everybody happy. But you can hold down in history at the same time. Anyway, I decided to see it. It was a good fun back and forth. But the icing on the cake was basically, I, I, I guess the cake he's going to eat at the table. Depending on, I guess, who makes the cake. But the Rock always liked pie. I also thought he was gonna do a pie thing. I ain't gonna lie. I thought I thought he was gonna come out and just do a, do a pie thing. Just like I, um, I I don't know. I didn't see head of the table. That's all I'm trying to say. Which also means that he must be cleared up for a while with no movies or something. Uh, he ain't got no contracts going. You know that way he can do this. You know thing or whatnot either. But hey, we might be getting the Rock and Roman. WrestleMania 40. I'm about to say 50. I was too far in the future. I was, I was like, hell, that might be when Cody finished his story. I was like, I, I don't want to. I was like, I don't want to hurt nobody's feelings out here. But anyway, I was like, hey, if you ain't seen the segment, I was like, go ahead and watch it. You're going to be part of probably the 100 million views or whatever it's going to do. Uh, hell, he did 100. I think he did 100 million last time. Like, like, that day or something. And he said head of the table. Cause you already know what they're going to headline with. Yeah, yeah. I was like, yeah, so. I was like, we're, we're going we're gonna to see how this goes. Anyway, what do you think? How did you feel about his little tease? Where you think it's going to go? I was like, are you ready for this WrestleMania season? Huh? How are we going to do this? But anyway, just know that The Rock has finally. Maybe put put his name in the hat or on the table for WrestleMania. Got to come up with some better table pawns. Anyway, like the video, appreciate it. If not, nobody cares about your jabroni ass. It doesn't matter. I mean, well, it kind of matters. If, if, the, the eyebrow, I'll see you to talk about more rock later on.